Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy A34 5G. And yeah, for that we will need the file explorer and there's already one pre-installed. Huh? So have a look here in the app drawer for the Samsung folder and you will find the app named My Files. Okay, first of all you have a very nice overview here and the categories with all your images, videos, audios and so on. But we will need now the point here, internal storage. And you will find all the data on the internal storage which one is able to move to the SD card later. Yeah? Um, I would recommend to you to start with the pictures and videos you have done with your camera. And you will find them here at the DCIM folder. And then here in the camera folder. Okay, and here are all your pictures you have done with your camera and yeah. Now choose the pictures or videos you want to transfer and long press one of them. Then it's marked and now you can mark also the other ones you want to transfer. In case you have many like in my case here just tap here on top to select them all. Huh? Now very important go on move. Huh? Or you can go also on copy if you want to transfer data for the safety no? and keep your um, original data here on the phone. But I would recommend to you to go and move so that we have more storage here on the phone. Go and move. Okay, now go back one step and another step and another step so that we are back in the main overview here. And now I can switch to the SD card. Okay, now we are on the SD card and uh, I would recommend to you that you create some folders so that you don't lose the overview later. Huh? So I've done it already here. If you want to create folders, just tap you on the three points and go on create folder and then you can some organize as then you can organize some folders for your pictures, uh, for your documents and so on. Uh, so as I've said, I've done it already here. I've already here an existing DCM folder. And now just go on move here to transfer your marked pictures here from the phone to the SD card. Okay, it's done. Pretty easy as you can see. And yeah, let me show you something else. Let's go back to the internal storage here. Uh, the same thing what I've shown you with files, you can do the same thing also with the complete folder. No? So just long press one of these folders and you can mark them also no? and move them also directly to the SD card. So pretty nice. Please take care that you don't take for this which one contains only documents like mp3 files or also audio files or uh, pictures, videos and so on, but no operating system data. No? So that could damage the system here and you can't use your phone anymore. But usually you uh, see just for this which one contains only um, yeah, movable data. No? And yeah, just go and move and the same thing, uh, you can transfer it also to your SD card. So pretty, pretty easy. Let me show you something else. Now, for that, just go to the camera here uh, because your future pictures now should go also to the SD card. No? In case if you see that here, just go and change. But in case if you don't see this message, just tap here on the settings and scroll down a bit to the point storage location. And you should make sure that it's not anymore the internal storage. So choose here the SD card because that means that your future pictures and videos you will take with your camera, they go directly to the SD card and you save a lot of time because you don't have to transfer them always um, and so on. Yeah, I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me some time. That would be very helpful for more videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for, and I've created also some other uh, videos if you're interested in with some more tips and tricks and so on. Or you can also subscribe me to don't miss a new video. Thank you so, so much for your support and uh, yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao!